have a guest talk. It has a started recording. Now, um, announcement on our today we have a guest talk, okay? And the guest talk is at 3 p.m. UTC. Okay, 3 p.m. UTC, and he is a professor. And trust me, guys, you really don't want to miss it. Okay, now he's a professor, professor, professor Axel Gonga. Okay, now he's a Cameroonian and um, he has over of experience as a researcher. Okay, developing algorithms for you know uh, machine learning natural language processing um he's a full professor for data science okay now um he is going to have a discussion with you guys and um with his wealth of experience in data science machine learning you know natural language processing trust me you really do not want to miss it out okay so it is at 3 p.m utc let us all come prepared and you know let us try to be engaging because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity to have um almost like a one one-to-one -one conversation with him and then just you know ask questions make meaningful contributions and let's just learn from each other okay so today at 3 um p.m Universal time, okay? UTC, he's going to be there, and we are hoping that everyone is going to be a part of the the town hall meeting. Okay, so um, yes, another thing, um, I I think I've forgotten. Well, anyway, I'll I'll let you know. So let's get straight into this morning's stand up, okay? So um. We would really love to know, because especially um, that this week eight, we are working on um, a competition that is outside of the, um, the branch of 10 Academy. It's not something that we are controlling, but then it's something that we believe you could participate in, okay? We really want to know what you've done so far, because today's Thursday, you're supposed to submit on Saturday. So we want to know what you've done so far, what you're going to do today, you know, what you plan on doing today, and if you have any major blocker, or probably you gained an insight, there was something you learned, you know, that you could share with the rest of the team. So it's possible someone else might be going through that, okay? So, um, who wants to start us off this very beautiful Thursday morning? Who wants to start us off this morning? This morning we have a very small crowd. So Deborah, thank you so much. Go ahead. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How are you? Good morning, Deborah. I'm good. Uh, for this week's challenge, uh, we, I have been working in a team and we have been able to load the data, the given data, and try to do some pre-processing on it and do some EDA. Uh, yeah, and we are taking some approaches that we have learned on previous weeks, like the, the concept of causality and try to experiment with that. So uh, for today, we're going to be uh, doing more analysis and try to get more data to do a uh, deeper uh, analysis on our data and get more uh, get more uh, a better and uh, a better more useful interpretation for okay. the blockers uh, we are have uh, me personally I'm having a tr trouble submitting because I was added as a collaborator Okay. So you're can, having trouble submitting what? Uh, for example, I can work on one version, and I have to send it to my teammates to submit. I can't submit on my own. Okay. Yeah, okay. I, I'm having trouble with that. Okay. Okay. Um. Thank you so much, Deborah. Um anyone here who probably has gone through that problem of having trouble to submit but they've been able to um they've been able to sort, sort it out anyone um i see 10 academy i don't know abu Bakr, if it's you or if it's Yabu Bill. 
Yeah. Yeah, we we faced uh, sorry to interrupt but Yeah, 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 it's fine. Yeah, we uh, we have faced that problem, but when we see the documentation uh, in terms of submission, it says only one person can submit if you are working with an team. Okay. 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 So um, thank you so much, Samuel. Um, so Deborah, I think um, you should be good because if you check the documentation, as Samuel has said, um, only one person from a group or a team can submit. So I think you guys should be fine, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, okay, thank you so much. Um, any other person? Okay, um, well, we're going to go the old school way. So I'm going to start us off with just one person and then after you go, you're going to select the next person to go and on and on, okay? And if somewhere in the middle, someone has any question to ask or anything, a comment, you could just raise up your hand, okay? So let's start off with um, Desmond. Desmond, good morning. How are you? Good morning, Hester. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. So what's good on your end? Um, well, this morning I'm, I'm fine. Um, okay. And I appreciate for that. The weather is a little bit chilly. It's cold. Um, <laughs> but um, we, we are doing good. And um, I was able to do my interim submission yesterday. Um, I had explored the data and also um, done a little bit of the pre-processing. Okay. Yeah, so um, with that, today I'll see uh, what, how to proceed further. Okay, so um, specifically proceeding further how? Specifically doing what? Um, just trying to get to understand, um, uh, to create some, um, to, to, to understand the, uh, the, the data and then just uh, do some statistical modeling uh, with the data that I have. Okay, that sounds like a good plan. That sounds like a great plan on this moment. Okay. Um, thank you so much for that. So um, you can select the next person. Um, I would select uh, uh, Jakinda to go next. <laughs> okay, thank you. Jakinda, good morning. It looks like you're on the hot seat this morning. Hi, Yachi. How are you? I'm good. Uh, okay. Sorry, what am I required? To, uh, okay, the progress, good. Okay, uh, uh, yeah, your no, progress so far, what you're doing today, um, if you've had any major blocker, were you able to handle it on your own? What did you do specifically? We just want to, um, you know, have an understanding of what's going on, you know, get a map, a roadmap of where you're going. Uh, okay, cool. So uh, we, we, we're doing it in a team of five people. Uh, okay. We submitted our first, uh, we submitted a notebook as required. Uh, we did uh, EDA, uh, we, we broke, uh, because we had different data sets, so everyone was performing EDA on the different data sets, and then we merged. And uh, right now we are supposed to meet and discuss on uh, how to handle causality and if we can also do some future profit work. So yeah, that's that's the, the next plan. So today we're just going to handle that and uh, see if we can come up with something good. Okay, that sounds like that sounds like a good plan. That sounds like a good plan. And um, it's good that you guys have been able to, you know, separately work and then you put it together. That's good. Okay, um, thank you yeah. so much, Jackie. How's the weather over there? Is it still chilly? 
Uh, it's cold, my friend. It's cold. I know. Yeah. But yeah, yeah uh, it's good for us. It's a season. Yeah, I think uh, I'll choose Jerusalem to go next, if that's okay. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Hi, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. So what's good okay. on your end? Yeah, yesterday uh, I submitted uh, the first interim submission. Uh, I've been uh, doing with the EDA part and also data processing. I gained some insights and we will continue doing that by today and also try to add some new things on that. And yeah, it's going on good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's going good. Okay. okay. You sound. Yeah, I just. Um, uh, I'm not actually with the team, and uh, yeah. Uh, thank you. Okay. Okay. Well, otherwise, are you good? Are you comfortable with the with the competition? Everything is okay. Yeah, yeah. I do like that. I do like the competition. Plus, uh, I'm getting insights. Uh, so, for me, it's good, and it's going to get. Yeah. 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 Okay. 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 Um, yeah. Thank uh, you. So, yeah. Okay. Sure. Uh, am I going to choose or? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Um, I've never heard of Petal MT Sci, so. Oh, okay. That's a, good, a very good choice. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Bethlehem. How are you this morning? Today I managed to submit on time and we were working on, I'm working in groups of two and uh, we were working on the EDA part and we were working on the different assets and then we were able to merge it. And today we are going to uh, try to come up with other data sets so that we can merge it to ours and uh, do a deeper analysis. So that's our plan for today. Okay, that's good. That's good. It's and you were able to submit on time yesterday. Okay, so that's one step forward. Okay. So um, any other major blocker that probably you guys faced, but you able to get past it okay so i have also faced the same issue as Deborah. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, my uh, my teammate couldn't submit his work and we had to work on different versions and then uh he he needs to send me what he has done and then i was the one that was going to submit but i think that's how it should be done and we're okay with it okay 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 so that's good that's good okay all right, so um, yeah, let's get Sorry. the next person from you. Okay. I think Rachel yeah. should commit to Rachel. Sorry, Rachel? Rachel. Yeah. Okay, okay, thank you. Rachel, good morning. Can you join us? Hello, good morning. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. So, what's good on your end? What's going on? What have you been up to? What are you going to do today? So uh, what I've been doing is just to understand what the problem was all about, understand the Kego things, how it's, how it's done. So I've been able to, to, to extract data and try to bring some useful insights. So I think um, I'm doing my best to, to get the insight by doing some exploration, the data we have. So uh, I think that today I will continue with the tasks. Yeah. Okay. Well. Yeah, sure. Thank you. Okay. Were you able to submit yesterday? Yeah, yeah. Um, I submit uh, a bit late, but I have submitted. Okay. Okay. So it sounds like you're working alone, right? 
Uh, yeah, uh, I've been working alone from Monday, Tuesday, but to yesterday, uh, I've been in contact with Zano. Yeah, I, I said, okay. oh, yeah, I'm working with Zano. Yeah. Okay. 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 Definitely. That's good. That's good to hear. All right. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So let's get the next person from you. Okay. Okay. Oh, let me see. Uh, about Beza, Beza Italian. Okay. Thank you. Beza, good morning. How are you? Good morning, Yati. Good morning, everyone. Um, so as, um, um, as yesterday, I, I tried to do the pre-processing. Um, and uh, I didn't manage to merge the data, but uh, we kind of uh, working as uh, not as a as a team, but we are kind of discussing as a team with the ladies. Dorothy and Rich is also here, yeah. But uh, since everyone uh, started to submit uh, as a group or as a, or as an individual, we couldn't like we weren't sure that we sh we can like add as uh, other teams as a collaborator. So we keep uh, we could uh, submitting as we start. But we wanted it to do on a group. I'm not sure if anyone tried that. We were scared if, it, if there's going to be a disqualification if we're going to add the collaborators after submission. If anyone like tried that, uh, I would like to know. Other than that, today I will try to do. I did submit some part of the the, the interim report, but I'm not satisfied with the, what I. Uh, Submitted, so I'll try to do more today. Yeah, that's what's going on with me. Okay, Beza, that's quite a lot going on. And um, guys, if anyone has been able to an answer to Beza's question, uh, probably you could check out the documentations, you know, the rules and everything, just to be on the safe side. But for every anyone here, sorry, um, has gotten um a knowledge about that, definitely. Um, send her a DM or you could just send a message on get chat so that you can see. Okay, um, yeah. Double bell. Okay. So, no, I, I was just checking about some of, I, I don't know, maybe you guys have seen it already, but there are these the frequently asked questions side, some things that explains a little bit. Um, so, in the I think in the discussion side, probably you have checked it. If you have checked it, it's fine. Uh, just if you haven't checked it, you get more information about different things, including how to form a team, for example. Uh, how can we merge teams? If you are submitting as a team, for example, it says you do not need to merge within the Kaggle platform. It's actually disabled, but all team members must be listed as collaborators on the submitted notebook and all team members must accept, must accept the competition rules before the submission deadline. So that basically means like you can actually for you can actually form, um, yeah, you know, in this way. I think it's very clear, and you can get you can learn more information that they give it there. So some of the important elements and what is an engagement index, you know, what uh, what to understand by some things and what is the format to make a submission, how do we join the competition, how do we form teams are listed there. So it's a, just good to check that uh, if you haven't already. And I'm, I'm sure some of you already um, have, have checked that. So if you have questions, I think in the discussion, uh, I think join the discussion. I, don't, I was trying to see if anyone actually submitted some code um, because it's important. If you submit really cool, something that is important that some people haven't yet done it will count for you and if you become like you know um, a lot more people checked it and download it or work on it extend it that's another clever way so if you are especially working in a team one of the advantage you have is that it is about what to open source you know if you look at it tensorflow pytorch and everything why do they open source because if they want other people using means they get noticed, it's an advertisement to be noticed. So don't just only work like a thing, even if you just have like a different plot that as somebody doesn't do, even if you, you spend some time, just give it for free as well. 
that's winning. That's kind of a winning strategy as well. So don't just only think for yourself, but like usually like how to be, if you can't, you can't win in many ways. One is to really be amazing and win it, like in that way. Another was to win the society, like basically just to have like you contributed enough that you get the credit for it. So don't just have one strategy. And especially if you are in a team, um, make sure to diversify and think like, okay, so the business context here is winning. And, and then what are the elements of that? It's like, so like, of course, doing you know, amazing work, plus what are other elements that we can leverage? And it's in that kind of mentality that you should always just think um, instead of just only focusing on one particular, which is like, okay, do the work linearly. Just I just want to say that that part. And I would of course like also just in the here an update in terms of like technicality, you know, how have you solved it? Is there any challenge that you have? Like given the complexity of the project, it would be nice just for me to hear where are you in that complex design? Like is it just tamed and you know you are you're all gone? Is it easy? Is it difficult? It would be nice for me just to to hear that update because I haven't been I wasn't able to uh, to join yesterday and the day before uh, to hear how how you are progressing. So a few people probably, if they can just give me an update. Is it complex? Is it hard? Is it easy? Um, that would be good. Thanks. Thank you so much, Yaga Bro. So um, thank you for sharing the frequently asked um, question page with us. So guys, you've had um, Yabba Bell's question. So um, Beza, who's going next? Mm -hmm. Should I choose? Yeah, yeah. Okay, has Deborah gone? Yes. Um, Binyam? Oh. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. How are you? I'm um, good. Uh, how are you? How I'm is doing everybody good. Doing? Uh, okay. Uh, so my update. Uh, firstly, uh, uh, I would like to thank you, the Team Academy, uh, for letting us participate in such kind of uh, huge project, uh, which influences policies and other strategies government strategies too. Uh, nextly, I'm currently at uh, the EDA part. I have uh, mostly done the pre-processing part, except uh, the merging, the merging the data. Uh, I was going through the data, you know, the filling process, uh, and uh, just, not just to drop uh, columns, as if uh, I can fill the, 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 the uh, the missing values using the uh, given data. Uh, yeah, so that's my update. And uh, I had uh, some technical questions. Uh, one is uh, uh, specifically in the percentage in the district. Uh, there is a so-called uh, percentage of uh, black people. Uh, and the given data has two, uh, two, has two values. And, how is it, uh, how is it uh, calculated? Uh, I would like to ask the community and I have about to. Yeah, that's my update. Thank you. Okay, so you would like to know how the percentage for black people are calculated? Uh, yeah, well, there are two values uh, in, every, okay. uh, in every given uh, set. So which one shall we use? Uh, should we average them or I didn't get the, 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 the that value. Okay. Okay. So the 10 Academy community, anyone who wants to talk to me and help Binyam with this? Yeah, yes, 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 I will, I will, I will, I will talk to him. Okay. Um, Paul, see, um, let's, um wait for Steshi and then you can just like join in okay let's see she see she has raised her hand uh, okay yeah i just wanted to say if it's those values that are in 
some sort of brackets. Uh, the way we've dealt it is uh, I look at it as an interval. We got that information from the community. It, uh, yeah, it's an interval kind of data. So we use the average of the two, the mean, yeah, of that okay. interval. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Um, Paul Z, do you want to add to that? No, I was about to say the same thing. Okay, okay, thank you guys so much. Um, Miniam, is that okay for you? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, that, uh, that, that works. Thanks, thank you. Guys. Okay, yes. So we have time for one more person before we move on to the Ask Me Anything. And guys, as per request, I'm the one on the hot seat today, okay? So I'm sure you really do not want to miss out. So, um, Biniam, who is going next? Uh, okay, has Malet uh, gone? Malet, um, okay, no. Uh, Malet's a tutor. Um, Sim has raised the hand, so let's hear from Sim. Um, hello, can you hear me? Yes, good morning, how are you? Good morning. Um, so... Basically, I was able to submit yesterday, but there wasn't much progress in the analysis, but that at least that says anything definitive. Um, the main problem that I've been having with the data is that you would get more analytical power if you were to use like external data sets that even they have shared. But the problem is that they have attempted to anonymize the districts. So you can't really link the districts to any external information. And you can only go on the information that is provided there, at least in that regard, unless you're going for statewide data, which doesn't really reflect the district by district nuances that would be more effective and helpful. Um, other than that, most of the analysis has been, I haven't really had to deal with the data much because I skipped that part and I'm just trying to do analysis that doesn't depend on the faulty data or just outright removing all of the null values so far, but probably other members of my team have figured out the processing part. And once we combine, I'll probably use the data, the process data set that they have made. Um, okay. I think that covers it. Okay. Okay. So, um, yeah. Um, do you want Yababal to help you specifically with something? Um, not particularly, I think. Okay, okay. Um, that's mm -hmm. if there was a no, I, I don't think there's um, no, go yeah. ahead. I mean, I, on, I thought about it, then, it's just it's a specific problem because, um, when you come down to it, identification. identification of the district almost impossible I didn't to identify so identifying them seems to be counterintuitive that's that's why I abandoned the question in that regard um, if there is if anybody has found educational uh, at least um, the semester the academic calendar that uh, would be helpful so. okay okay so there um, isn't a national um, data set that we could find that covers the whole school year and if anybody has found one that would be really helpful thank you okay thank you so much sim so he has requested if you could find the calendar and you share it um on 
look at chat so that he could have a look at it to help him with what he's doing then definitely that would be great um guys we are running we're not even running out of time we're actually out of time for this morning's stand up so if there's any other thing you encounter during the day just ask your question in the all week eight channel okay um we have a guest talk at three um it's professor um, um axel so definitely um he is has over 12 years experience in big data you know on machine learning so definitely you would want to be a part of it so it's 3 p.m utc the same um link that we always use so let's all try to be a part okay so um i'm going to stop recording and then we're going to start the ask me anything session and definitely as i've said i'm the one on the hot seat this morning for the ama so yeah so let me stop recording so we could start the session and